it's so great to be here. So my whole thing is I'm very like, wow! Like, that's my vibe. <laughs> and I don't know whether you're into that, but lately I'm like, why is that my vibe? You know what I mean? Like, what's my story? I'm like looking back and I'm like, Ugh. and I think that the reason why a lot of girls are very bubbly is because it's like a way to survive in like humanity. Like if you don't like me, that's on you. <laughs> like if I was a guy, I would have came out here so differently. Like I would have came out so slow. You know what I mean? Like, ooh, tired. Uh, eyelids, half mass, you know? I would have like looked you all up and down for a good five minutes and then finally been like, <sighs> let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> and you'd be like, wow, he's confident. <laughs> but I'm a girl, so I'm like, who here needs a kiss on the lips? <laughs> I know how. I think. Um, guys, it's pretty fun. I love uh, living in the now. Uh, do we have any virtual reality fans here? Any VR heads in the crowd? Anyone? Couple? Couple uh, Dave and Buster maniacs? Love it. Um, I guess I think VR is a really cool thing. It's like living in the future. I haven't done it yet. My friend called me up and she's like, oh my God, Sarah, I tried VR. And I was like, you did? How was it? And she was like, honestly? I don't think you'd like it. And I was like, oh, what? You know when somebody just tells you like how you are? I'm like, what do you mean I wouldn't like it? But then I got thinking about it, I'm like, well, I'm a comedian, I'm an artist. I'm always walking around like analyzing everything, taking like in so many things and being like, what does it all mean? Like maybe I couldn't handle VR. You know, like what if I put on a VR helmet? I'm like, whoa, man, what's going on? What does this mean to me? What does this mean to society? Like what if I love it in here? What if I can't get out VR? And she was like, no, I don't think you like it because you get car sick real easy. And I was like, uh, okay. And I feel like that's a perfect analogy of like how I think people see me versus how they actually see me. Like I'm always hanging back, like cool, leaning against a brick wall, you know, with my eyes closed. And I assume people are looking at me being like, whoa, who's that, a poet? <laughs> but really people are looking at me going, that girl has barf all over her. <laughs> Cause I do get car sick, guys. <laughs> I need mint gum, I need the window down, I need to stare straight ahead. <laughs> Nothing creepier than me in a car. <laughs> love being a passenger. I love, I'm a seasonal gal, and what I love about it is making like a list of things to do before each season, you know what I mean? Like this summer, I'm gonna do all the things. I'm gonna go water skiing. I'm gonna make summer love, you know what I mean? I'm gonna go to a music festival and donate blood. I don't know what people do.